guys, welcome back. Usually, I don't usually do like a dark lip this. <laughs> Well, let me get my words together. Usually, I don't do a dark lip like this, but for today's video, I was like, okay, I'm going to do a dark lip. Colourpop's uh, Limbo Stunning, okay? So, I hope you guys enjoy this look from start to finish, and let's begin. Alright, guys, so I'm starting off with a blank face and no makeup on my face. I'm going in with this Milk Makeup Moisturizer. If you want to know the correct term, it's actually called a Hero Salve, okay? It is so moisturized. If you guys follow me on Snapchat, you know my lips have been so dry. Then we're going to move on to foundation. I'm actually using three different foundations, okay? The first one I'm using is from Hourglass. This is a liquid to powder foundation. I love the consistency of it. If you have more, like, oily skin, this is a great foundation to try out the next foundation I'm also using is this one from Too Faced this is the born this way foundation okay this foundation works for many different skin types so definitely check it out and then the last one I'm using is actually a sample and it's a Bobbi Brown tinted moisturizer I'm just gonna apply this concoction to my face then for my concealer today I'm using the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer if you're wondering I'm applying this under my eyes with my beauty blender and I'm using the pointed side and by the way my beauty blender is dampened because this will help the product to apply on the skin much more flawlessly and also help the product to actually not move around on the skin Then I'm going to set my face with my Sasha Buttercup powder. I've absolutely been loving this. You guys have seen. I haven't been reaching for my Laura Mercier powder. What I love about this powder is it helps to set my makeup and help it to make it more long-lasting or stay on my face longer throughout the day. Then I just like to set my eyelids with powder just to make sure my liner stays in place throughout the day. For the liner today, I'm first going to be using the L'Oreal liner. And this is one of their cat eye liner. And I'm just doing a simple wing liner. I think liner is one of those things that take time. So just practice, practice. And... It shall happen, okay? I actually have a video on how to do wing liner, so I'll link it down below for you. Next, I also go back over my wing with the Ico liner. I think this liner is, like, very pigmented. It's a fat tip, so I don't like to use it to do my wing. Then for lashes today, I'm using Absolute New York Lashes in AEL 12. I always get compliments on these. They're gorgeous, super inexpensive, guys. Check it out. Then I've been also been loving putting shadow in the crease of my eyes. So I usually go with like a brown or like a warm orange or like a warm red. I'm using today this Anastasia Modern Renaissance palette if you're wondering. And I'm going to use this orange shade. And I'm just applying this in the crease of my eyes just to really define that eye. If you're not a lover of eyeshadow, this is definitely like a quick trick to like look like you did like extra work. But you really didn't, okay? Then I'm going to move on to highlighting. I'm using the Makeup Forever Pro Highlight in Golden. I've been obsessed with this highlight. I just apply it to my cheeks, um, my nose area, and then also right by my cupid's bow sometimes. It just really varies where I want to put my highlight. Set my face with my Maybelline Setting Spray. I like to always set my makeup, especially after I do my highlight and all my foundation is on and all that good stuff, to highlight under my eye or my lash line of my eyes, my lower lash line. I'm going to be using this LA Girl liner and it's in white if you're wondering. Then to top off my bottom lashes, I'm going to add some mascara. This is a L'Oreal mascara. Then also I'm going to add on this Maybelline mascara. Then lastly for my lips, I'm using ColourPop's Limbo. I wore this on Snapchat and everyone was like, oh my god, I love that lip color even on Instagram. Like, thank you guys. It's gorgeous, okay? At first I was like, eh, but then I was like, I love it. It's like a beautiful deep brown, perfect for the winter fallish time, okay?
this is the final look. Make sure you guys give this video a like and subscribe down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Adios.